project is designed to detect motion and monitor temperatures within the pool. An alarm is triggered based on that motion. The purpose of this project is to alert homeowners that a small child or pet could have fallen into the pool. They will also be notified through their phones. Our device is using two microcontrollers. One is used as the transmitter and the other as a receiver. The microcontroller is collecting information from sensors and sending it to the receiver. The first sensor is an accelerometer which is measuring the movement within the pool. The second sensor is for measuring the temperature of the water in the air. The other microcontroller is the receiver. It processes the data sent over by the transmitter. Based on the data received, it will set off the alarm through pulse width modulation. The alarm in our device is a buzzer. Our microcontroller is also controlling a camera. If the alarm is triggered, then the microcontroller will also send a signal to the camera so that it can take an image of the pool area, which will then be sent to the user's phone. With the use of an application, communication between the microcontroller and the phone will be established. The user is able to read the temperature and alarm status and view the image sent when the alarm last went off. The final component connected to the receiver is the display. The display will show the temperature reading, time, and the alarm status. Our full system will, be, will look like this. The transmitter is sending data over radio frequency to the receiver where it will be processed. Here you can see the transmitter. This is the transmitter sending the X, Y, and Z values. If we see the X reading, you can see that it rotates from 0 to 90 degrees. Then as I put it back down, it goes back down to 0. This is an image of our receiver. The receiver at this point is receiving from the transmitter. The value is the angle that it's receiving. So it is rotating to 90 degrees and back down to 0 degrees. This is our calibration process. The calibration process is something that the user should do at initial setup. It collects data over 30 seconds and finds a new threshold. Once the calibration is completed, in this case it is 5 degrees, and 5 degrees is a new threshold.